Hey Zinkarn, this is going to be part 2 of my World Superstars box opening. So if you haven't checked out part 1 already, please be sure to check that out. Pulled some pretty cool stuff in the beginning and end of that video. So yeah, so let's go ahead and get started. Uh, let's go ahead and start with the Blaze Man packs just because. So yeah, I just decided to split it up because my camera usually runs out of storage space. So one video will be very long and the other is usually really short. So yeah, I just figured I'd go ahead and do it this way. So hopefully we can pull one of the shorter print cards. That'd be awesome. I'm not gonna bother uh, naming some of these, so yeah. We have a high five this guy. Looks pretty good as a prismatic secret rare, I guess. But not too sure what it does, so we need to read that up later. Again, I really wish the packs were a bit sturdier. Uh, Natria dude, Ghost Trick, a uh, Numeral Hunter, god damn, I, so many of them, what the hell, kinda hope it turns out to be like uh, one of the best cards of the set or something, or pricey cards later on, who knows. Dijin, Flower, another Go Go Go, and nice is Star Star Scepter, second one of that, pretty nice. Seems some people open the box and they only pull like at most one of each of them, so who knows? And I really want to save the pack art on this. Alright, there we go. Scale. Yeah, I'm getting like triples of stuff in this box now. That's kind of sad. Ah. And it's not really exactly of the better stuff of the set, in my opinion, so kind of unfortunate. But what do you do? The box ratios for this set is so random. That dude. Ooh, another note of him. A nice Elemental Hero Blaze Man. Didn't get him yet, so very nice. Last Blaze Man pack, and then six packs of number 86. Come on. Damn. The struggles of pack opening. I really wish it they go back to the old mid but because it was so much sturdier and harder to open. Or at least Yeah. Do 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 this thing. Yep. And nice! One of them definitely beautiful. Legendary Dragon of White. That is amazing. So yeah, this is definitely one of the short prints I saw like in two cases, someone only pulled ten of these, so Definitely happy about that. Makes you wonder, do I want to preserve the packs and be kind of rough, or there's something inside? Yeah, just kind of rambling now. Alright. So many of him. What the hell? Like, that's not even funny to me anymore. Like, I literally have pulled four copies of him. And I've counted, so yeah, four copies. Now, if it was of the legendaries, like four copies of one of them, that would just be amazing. But four copies of Numeral Hunter, I mean, it's a pretty good card, but depending on what decks you play against, yes. <laughs> Whoa, nice, I got a place of the scepters now. That's pretty awesome. At least this box isn't all that bad, especially since I was able to pull the Legendary Dragon of White. I guess that was kind of the main thing I was looking for, as well as the numbers from the set. Honestly, I really wanted to complete like the whole set since I collect more than play nowadays, but yeah. Jolt counter, that. Gaga got sister. Now this is actually one of the very beautiful prismatic secrets in the set, so yeah. I think this makes Gaga God decks pretty playable. So we have three packs left. Let's see, do we have any magic in these last few packs? 
and can they open? I'll just tear it. Honestly. And we have a marshalling field as our prismatic secret. Humpty Grumpty, Heroic, Mega Fan Beast, and a Ghost Trick Break. Next pack. Honestly, these things like rip so easily. That's kind of annoying. Let me know if you guys ever try to save the pack art on your packs as well, and how you deal with this nowadays. Yeah, that one opened up pretty nicely. Photon Stream Destruction. Whoa. That little dot right there. Another that, another 79, and a Galaxy Soldier. I think that's a duplicate. So, last pack. Is there magic in this? Let's see. I think I've already pulled all the numbers in the set, so honestly, regarding numbers collection, I'm pretty much set. And yeah, just otherwise, really want to pull some of the short printed cards. Just to have for collection purposes and just because they're pretty pricey, so it wouldn't be it wouldn't hurt to have them. Alright, save that. Drago Roar. Heroic Challenger. Augmented Heraldry. Honestly, I think I've only pulled like one of this card, so that's kinda weird. And then the Heraldic Beast in the set. And our last prismatic secret rare. And it's Pendulum Impenetrable. Alright, so Excuse me for a second while well, I'm going to go ahead and organize this awesome box. Again, let's go ahead and like focus on the beautiful card right there while I organize this as best I can. So yeah. And sorry for the delay since like... This box did come out yesterday, but because of shipping, I only received it today. And, yeah. And since I'm not good with editing, it's, everything's just going to have to be the way I film it, so it'll take some more time for this kind of stuff for me to organize. So got the stuff in order now. Let's go ahead and get started. So just gonna go over the prismatic secrets. Got number 86, which is beautiful. Got three of F0, Utopic Future, so yeah, that's a thing. Two of the Galaxy Soldiers. Damn it, I think I slightly bent one of them, but yeah. Four numeral hunters. Yeah, that's... Hopefully it turns out to be very good. So we have two Pendulum Impenetrables, Earth Shattering Event, two Onomatopoeia, a Marshalling Field, High Five the Sky, and on to some of the higher, better Prismatic Secrets in my opinion. Again, 86 is pretty awesome though for numbers collecting. So we have Gaga Ga Sister, uh, Elemental Blaze Man, Star Set of Scepter, which I was very happy to pull a full play set of, so that's going to be very awesome. Also got Chronomaly Nebra Disc. I believe this is one of the shorter print cards as well. And the Legendary Dragon of White. So yeah, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please be sure to rate, comment, subscribe, and definitely leave a comment down below about what you guys thought about my opening and what you guys have pulled yourselves if you have purchased any of this set. So yeah, thanks for watching, and Azine Card out.